I said what I said about Yellow Beezy. What did you say about Yellow Beezy? I said Yellow Beezy is not likable in, in Dallas oh, right yeah. now. No, I don't. I, that, y'all agree on that, but I don't bro, agree on that. I, I know why he's saying it. I don't give a damn. You was already a hater, bro, though. No, I'm not, I'm not, y'all niggas I, haters. I'm not hating on Yellow Beezy. Well, you gotta be. I I said, yeah, project, this project he dropped is probably one of his best projects. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Talking about who's <laughs> doing this, just building your fan base. Like, it's niggas who don't know, probably don't even know about you. Yeah, that's tapping in to see what. Okay, why the fuck you talking about this nigga like that? Like every time right, somebody say something about me, I don't they help a lot, bro. No, I enjoy. Like it. all these people say whatever they want to say, but at the end of the day, I don't care. Like exactly, you can say what you want. It don't affect me. That's shit. true, and that's, that's why I can say what I want to say because you can say what the fuck you want to say. Back. Exactly, it's I'm, cool. I'm the type of nigga you'll never hear me speak down on on another man like that. So like, let me. I, I don't talk down. Let me ask you this: Like I did the Big D interview, I said what I said. That's about my nigga right there. I said what I said about Yellow Beezy. What did you say about? Yellow Beezy. I said Yellow Beezy is not likable in, in Dallas oh, right yeah. now. No, I don't. Y'all agree on that, but I don't bro, agree on that. I, I know why he's saying it. I don't give a damn. You was already a hater, bro, though. No, no, I'm not. Y'all niggas I, haters. I'm not hating on Yellow Beezy. Well, you gotta be. I, I said this, project, this project he dropped is probably one of his best projects, bro. Man, Yellow Beezy, Yellow Beezy, one of the dopest niggas when it come down to Dallas and with his movement, he did his thing. Get that he nigga. Got, get that nigga. He's the biggest nigga. He's a good rapper. Everybody wanna be really He's a good rapper, Why bro. Not, if you got some good, a lot of good rappers out here, man. But this nigga is on another level from a lot of the rappers. Man, that facts. Here. He's a star. So He's we can't, star we can't deny Dallas. that. But we, nigga, but is niggas treating him like that in Dallas right now? It don't matter. That's, That's his an fault. answer the question. But it doesn't matter. Answer the, yes, it does matter. Why they does treat it matter? him if he's, if he's our biggest artist. They need to treat him no, like that. No, it don't matter because he don't come out like that. Man, but they still need Why? to treat him like that. How is it? How, who, how well, is it Sean Cotton is our biggest blogger. Do they treat him like that? Sean Cotton don't really care. About Dallas, well, that, he let it be clear. Like I don't care, I don't need y'all, I don't need y'all. Well, y'all ain't, and ain't nothing wrong with that. Him. He can't say that. He don't have to say that. He he does what he does in the lane that he does it in. He not he's an artist. When he go outside of Dallas, you ain't gonna get that love at home like that, man. You hey, not gonna get that love hey, unless you outside like, of Dallas. Are they playing Yellow Beezy? Yeah, some places. Yeah, where. Yeah, some what, song, what song you heard? Easy. What song have you heard while you was out of town? Man, Be honest. I, really, I can't just say which say one. one. Say you one. Say one. Of course, you, you heard them. So you heard them out of town. That's on me. Played everywhere. Recently. That's on me. Played everywhere. Recently. What'd you say? Recently. I answered a question, but that don't mean it's true. Because I don't hear them, but it don't mean it's true though. That's right. You you could say Bro, you don't when hear. When I go out of town, I'm asking people what Dallas rappers y'all know. I'm asking that. I'm a blogger. Didn't we That's do what that I'm asking. Did we, so when, I recorded. Who y'all know? I did. We at? I went to California. No, every recorded single time you do it. I ain't drop it though. When we went to Chicago. Was so bro, bro. What did they say? They knew Yellow Beezy. Yeah. And they, they knew Mo3. They know Yellow Beezy. I'm not saying they don't know him. I'm not That's saying what, it like songs. that. What I'm just saying, like when I be like, yeah, we if we get down to it, like yeah, I know he had that one song, like yellow. That's that's on me. But if 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 the city where he from, like played him, like Body made a good point. Shout out Body to B. He made a good point. Like Dallas don't even play none of the hits that came out of here in the club regularly. Like we don't hear like we don't hear that's on me in the club no more. We don't hear some Mo three songs in the club no more. We don't hear Queda in the club no more like that. Like it's not. They went once the song out. It's like they don't even keep them alive. Like this is the music that's that's breaking barriers. We need to keep playing this so when people come from out of town, they know like. Do you blame that it's on the radio? Shit. You blame that on the it radio? It can't just station? be the radio. It's the oh, DJs. it's a lot of the, it's a, it's somebody to be blamed. It's the radio. It's the DJs. It's the person. But it started it's, it's at the, the radio. Ra- it's the rappers too. It started though. at the radio. It's the, or the DJs. Too. It's the rappers too. Like Why the, is rappers it the rappers get to make the relationship with the people who still pushing their music. If the, these people are in position to do something with music, you should have a relationship with them where they still playing your shit and keeping you alive. So whenever you do come back with another one, it's like, okay, here you got another one. Let's go. Do you think that you? you so you you don't you a, you might as well you've been here forever. You love the, the, the Dallas music. I fuck with movie. Dallas. But what's I, the what's the? I mean, who? There's no if, solution until if people it, come up with their own solution. Not, yeah, how hard as we work. Do you feel like we work hard enough here? Because I think this nigga question who we are. You gotta watch this nigga. We work very hard. <laughs> this, you but know, there's always room for improvement. See, you know what I'm saying? When you, when you, this is what makes us different. Okay, I, I said it there for a reason. What makes us different is the way that you know we. You got me and my wife here. Then you got me and Money and Moses. We coming from different angles than a lot. I've never really seen it. I heard y'all finna do a podcast with Solo Lucci. No, that's not true. Who told you that? No, we interviewed him. We interviewed him. No podcast. No. Okay. What are your sources? 
Who oh, told you that? I'm talking nigga? too much. I said I've said too much. The pot has been stirred. Damn. <laughs> Nah, he just putting it out there. Oh, he nah, really believe that. I mean, I you know, know what bro, we got could have been true. We got a lot of stuff you going do on. A lot of, I seen like a lot of different people come. I seen you because we got we got we got some stuff Bobo. coming. Yeah, I we do that. guest hosts. We yeah, do we do guest hosts, hosts. Okay. but but that's about it. I do that for a reason too, because at the end of the day, I want to hear from other people a lot of times and see what their perspective is. You know, yeah, yeah, yeah. I had Solo Lucci messed up too. Let me, let me say that. Why I you say know, that? I really ain't know all his. Oh, he got some. I ain't know he all oh, his he did a lot of stats. Nah, for sure, he really don't get enough credit around here. No, but he definitely. But that's a lot of our artists here. Like that's where it got to get better. But it got to be a relationship between the artists I and mean, these people so that, that they know. Bro, I, when he came here, I I definitely he one of those guys that we really really respected the way he came on the platform and gave us a great interview. I can't lie, the nigga came and stayed all the time, performed, did, had a good time in this hole. We shut, we stayed all night almost in this hole, talking to so that nigga kicked it over here, nigga. We kicked it all the way to about one or two. Wasn't it about two when we left this hole? Like we kicked it. Man, I thought you was huh? Three in the morning. It was about three. See, my son was here. <laughs> Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.